Hi, I'm Artie Sequera, and I'm going to show you how to make one of my favorite pasta dishes, peanut noodles. This is a fantastic recipe that people go crazy for, and it couldn't be easier. This is one of my favorite things to do with pasta, peanut butter and pasta. I mean, really, it sounds odd, but it's really delicious. And the first thing that I do is I make a little cucumber salad to go with it. Um, I shaved these cucumbers really wicked thin on a mandolin. You can slice them as well and then just sprinkle them with a little bit of sugar, white sugar. I know it sounds odd, but actually it tastes delightful with the vinegar, which you're then gonna sprinkle on top, just some rice vinegar. Okay, a little bit of salt. And while you're making the rest of your stuff, just plop it in the fridge and it'll marinate and taste unbelievable. Next step is to make the delicious peanut sauce. And this makes a ton of sauce, which is great because then you can use leftovers on chicken and all that kind of stuff. So the first thing you need is um, some peanut butter. And I use chunky peanut butter because then those peanuts get freshly ground. So you have that nice fresh peanut taste. Next, I have some sesame seeds that I toasted. And I'm gonna put most of them in there and save some for a garnish. Some soy sauce and then some aromatics, some ton of ginger, six tablespoons. Don't be scared, you're barely gonna taste it, but it's gonna taste really good. And then four cloves of garlic. This is some red wine vinegar. For a little bit of heat, I have some hot sauce, some Thai hot sauce. You can use Tabasco as well. A little bit of brown sugar, some sesame oil, and then this is the weirdo one. This is a cup of hot black tea. And there you go. <laughs> Time to put it all together, all your components. First, your delicious peanut sauce. And then you can put whatever vegetables you want in there. I have some nice red bell pepper. Yum, yum, so good for you. And some asparagus, some really thin um, asparagus that I'm actually gonna serve raw. And then a little bit of lime just to freshen up all those flavors. And the rest of those sesame seeds that we saved there's a great dish for vegetarians, put all kinds of vegetables, you can put tofu in it as well. Um, but I also have it with chicken quite often too, so it's a complete meal. Okay, my favorite time, serving time. So get a nice big serving, and then these nice cold crisp cucumbers on the side. There you go, finishing touch, and they're beautiful. So there you go, those are my peanut noodles. Give them a try and let me know what you think. Get more recipes at goodbite.com.